Look, Peyton Royce extremely talented. Her attitude, that's something else. She's been nothing but sweet to me, Saxton. Point, especially considering who's involved here tonight. You're absolutely right, Michael. This match will be one we'll be talking about for a long time to come. <laughs> the women's locker room and with that in mind I expect to see them use every trick in the book to secure a victory here tonight. We're talking behind each other's backs now they are face to face and pretty soon fist to fist. Guys Tampa has such a rich history and I know the competitors here tonight will do everything in their power to live up to that legacy. to the kidneys. Golly. Connected on that. Oh, no. Someone call the orthodontist. Caught off guard. Delivering the suplex. And she's getting fired up here. Really taking control here. Way too early. Scoop slam. Peyton Royce to take advantage. Go behind. Breaker. That offense taking a toll on her. She can withstand the punishment, though. Close line over the top row. All the way to the floor. Whoa. You know what my favorite part of SummerSlam is? Everything. Knee is a lethal weapon. Peyton Royce was able to get out of the way there. Big boot! Not what she was looking for. Kick to the cut. Royce's career is just getting started, guys. I say she has already accomplished a great deal, including being named the 2016 NXT Breakout Star of the Year alongside Billy Kay. Simply said, this is going to be a great match. Oh. I can't get no. Damn. Stratisfaction. She's lost some of that energy she had earlier. She needs to turn the tide here. 
that NXT Breakout Star of the Year award Michael brings up is something for Peyton to be proud of, especially when you look at who she and Billy Kay beat to take home the hardware. Yeah, there were certainly some big names there, but in the end, it was the iconic duo walking away with the win. She is just dominant. Look who it is. Uh, what's this about? She's got her. Belly to back suplex. Nice drop kick. Slips out of the ring. I like her thought process here. To the outside, which will start the referee's count. Once again, thank you for tuning into this great women's matchup. Oh. Split leg drop. Being taken down under. Momentum has clearly swung her way. Two, three. Peyton Royce did it. This is a matchup where in order to stand victorious, you must destroy an opponent's body, mind, and soul. We knew this had to happen this way between these competitors. They absolutely cannot stand each other. Remember, no disqualifications. Anything goes. No countouts, no pinfalls, and no submissions. This is where you find out what someone's capable of with a match that takes brutality to a whole new level. Don't worry about repercussions or tomorrow. If you feel it, do it. The only limit is your imagination. You know what my favorite part of SummerSlam is? Everything. And finds a counter. Try to see a double after that one. Corey, some have said that targeting a competitor's leg in these matches is the best strategy. Do you agree? Well, it's the first thing I'd do. The whole purpose of this match is to not allow your opponent to stand. If you can't use your leg, you can't stand. I 
Oscar continued to build her legacy when she laid claim to being the first ever winner of a women's Royal Rumble match, a night that encompassed the trail many women before her blazed. Snap suplex. She's beginning to flag a little. She can withstand the punishment, though. Wow, she turned that one around. Ooh-wee. Wait a minute. Oscar turns it around. Nice job by Oscar. Not where you want to be at this point in the match, guys. Definitely not. Evading possible disaster there. She's going to try it again. Duplex. Asuka is trying to get in her opponent's head. Reflecting on that Royal Rumble match, Michael, Asuka entered 25th and had to battle old rivals and some of the greatest women's champions of all time. In the end, she prevailed to punch her ticket to WrestleMania. Yeah, Asuka was always my pick. I predicted it since the match was announced. There was never any doubt. No one was ready for Asuka. That's why you're the best ever, Corey. What a hit from Asuka. And Oscar was able to get out of the way there. Knee right to the gut. Guys, I think Oscar is a rare competitor that only gets stronger the more hits she takes. They just anger her. Don't do anything to disrespect Oscar. Doing so takes her to another place. And when you hear that guttural, primal scream of Oscar, it's like a warning of impending doom. Both wrists captured him. It's all academic at this point. Oh no, I don't like Asuka's chances in this one. Yeah. Elaborating on what Corey said about Asuka going to another place. When Asuka finds that next level, that other gear, she's near unstoppable. Well, it's like the Empress of Tomorrow plays chess while all of her opponents are stuck playing checkers. Four. I have the best job in the world. I get to sit here and call action of the greatest athletes on the planet today. We will go on. Asuka turns it around. Knee right to the gut. I'm no mathematician, guys, but by my calculations, a last man standing match is more than three times as brutal as a traditional match. After all, you only need to keep your opponent down for a three count in a traditional match. Three. Four. Asuka with the offense. That offense really hitting her hard. She's not looking good, guys, but we've seen her come back from worse in the past, and I'm willing to bet she can do it again here in this last man standing match. Oh, man, jarring headbutt. On the topic of traditional matches versus last man standing matches, Corey makes a great point. In matches such as this, you have to keep your opponent down for a count of 10, which oftentimes results in increased brutality and danger, Michael. Again, don't expect a technically sound competition here. This match will be much akin to a barroom brawl. Great match here, but if you missed any of the action from this week, just go to WWE's Facebook page, YouTube channel, Twitter, and more to get all caught up. Eight. What a SummerSlam this is. Every single match is off the charts. Referee's calling for the bell, the match is over. Take a look at how the Empress was haltered tonight. Here is your winner, the Witch. Big win over some very tough competition. Hey, she was the better woman of the two tonight. It's that simple. No surprise there. Never one lacking confidence. Bianca Belair looks poised and ready to compete. Byron, in the world of romance, this is what we call. She's gonna try. Oh, my. Corey, how exactly can an opponent compete against Bianca Belair's impressive athleticism? Well, the EST emanates confidence. If her opponent can prove to be stronger, faster, tougher, or better for just one second, it's gonna shake Belair. It's not going to be. Bianca Belair, big move coming. Spiked him. That can certainly do it. Here's Bianca Belair into the quick cover. One, two, We're in the feeling that process.
process here. Who's going to get the advantage and maintain control? I've seen some unique offenses over the years, Byron, but perhaps the most unique thing I've ever seen is when Bianca whips her opponents with her own hair. I have never seen anything like it, Michael. But I'll tell you what, if I was to give advice to anyone facing Bianca, it would be to turn the tables against her. Go ahead and whip her with her own hair. Can you guys believe the power? She's taking a beating here. She's not rising to the... Shoulders are down. Kick out at the last moment for Bianca Belair. To your point about Bianca's hair, Byron, I do think it's long enough that an opponent could likely use it as a weapon as well. No, nope, that won't work. Grabbing an opponent's hair can lead to disqualification. Uh, ooh, twist to the arm. This clutch into the elbow. Great technical prowess from Bianca Belair. Reverses, can she take advantage? That is a great reversal. Running close line. She's losing some. This could do it. This one's not over yet. She got the shoulder up. That's all that counts. Oh, it didn't go as planned there. Set up for a second time. Find the nearest exit. It's over. That might be the end of Maurice. I want to take a moment to thank all of you for tuning in to one of the greatest women's matchups. Here comes another one. Good night. I think that'll do it. The force of that impact should put it. This could do it. The big question, can Lana shock the world here tonight? Yeah, we're gonna find out if Lana is a mastermind or if she's just plain delusional making this challenge. Before the show, Naomi told me that tonight is about teaching Lana a lesson. She is that confident in her ability. Well, she's confident because she's one of the greatest performers we've ever seen. She's focused, athletic, and dynamic. She better be careful. Her hubris might be her downfall. I think she might have underestimated Lana a little bit here, and that could come back to haunt her. Time will definitely tell. Naomi may get this, folks. Times is that end of match. All that's left now is for Naomi to finish. And here we go, Naomi with a cover. And I can't believe this match is still going on. It's going to take more than that to keep her down. Simply said, this is going to be a great match.
I have the best job in the world. I get to sit here and call action. Naomi's going for it. Pile driver spiked him. But can they turn that into a... Can she do it here? The following contest is scheduled for one fall. It is for the WWE Divas Championship. This is a big time opportunity, Byron, as the title will be on the line here. Like, judging from the response on social media heading into this match, we're likely to see a new champ crown here tonight. Well, Corey, you think she's ready for a match of this magnitude? I do, Michael. I really do. This is what all that hard work has been about. All those extra hours in the gym. I guarantee you, she is more than ready for this match. and a huge opportunity for the champ to prove to everyone that there truly is none better in all of WWE right now. Well, there's no denying that this is one of the biggest title defenses of her championship reign. And as far as I'm concerned, there's no denying that she'll respond accordingly. You don't get to where she is in life by not knowing how to face a challenge. Big. Introducing the challenger from Ponta Vedra Beach, Florida, Mrs. Jason X. And introducing the champion from Mexico, she is the WWE Divas Champion, the Spider. The historic Divas title may have a new owner tonight. For nearly a decade, the Divas title was the pinnacle for women's wrestling, and it's back up for grabs tonight. Now, Michael, you and I were there to call the final defense of this title at Roadblock in 2016, and I am excited to call it again right here tonight. Yet another counter. It's like they're both somehow one step ahead of each other. Ooh. Nice drop kick. Slips out of the ring. I like her thought process here. Whoa. 
Got to be careful not to get counted out here. Harsh impact. Two. Proving tough to catch. Not a good spot to be, guys. This is terrible. Three. Time to end this. Wow! Cross screw oh. leg drop. The title's going nowhere. Kiss your dreams. Good night. The WWE Universe is on its feet, anticipating one of the most watched matches of all time here for the Women's Championship. But champions need to finish the job, unleashing it a second time. Let's go back and take another look. A big fight field, pressure cooker situation. WWE Universe hanging on every move. Bringing it back between the ropes. How great would that women's championship look around the waist of any of these talented young ladies? I want to take a moment to thank all of you for tuning... Oh, could this be it? Uh-oh. Here it comes. You know what my favorite part of SummerSlam is? Everything. Nothing's going to stop her now. The momentum is clearly turned to her favor. Incredible action in this match so far. She got out of the way. Here we go again. Amazing reflexes on display. She's going to try. Oh, what a counter. She's going to cut. Here's the setup. Ooh, bullseye. The challenger's hopes are slipping away. She's tough, but maybe not tough enough to get the win here. This is how you punish your opponent. The stuff in the leg. Just nasty. Now oh, trampling the opposition. Specifically targeting the leg. section reverses can she take advantage wow what a sequence oh what a close line forcefully delivered look out incredible impact for a little while now. She's fighting hard and it is paying off. Proving tough to catch. A striking blow. Oh, right to that gut. Look out. There it is. That is a game changer. 
Penny predicament. Two count. She just will not go away. Absolutely unreal. Oh my goodness, this is not good. Uh oh, here it comes. Extra. Boom! The title might change hands. Oh, I need a hands. That's gonna hurt. She is just dominant right now. She continues to press forward. Impressive in-ring IQ on display. Attack to the midsection. You've got to wonder how much has been taken out of these superstars thus far. And is there anything left? Wow, she turned that one around. This does not look good. This well, is exactly what you do not want to see. Human no. Anatomy wasn't built for this. Thank you. 
victory right there. And at this point, I think it's safe to wonder if the champ will ever lose to gold. And I'd say that match certainly lived up to SummerSlam's historic and prestigious past.